Hey, how's it going, guys? It's Joe with the Chocobo. We're picking up right where we left off. Ooh, that is a really swag-looking pterodactyl, though. Hey there, how you doing? You are a pleb, though, in terms of level. But we're going to just pick off right where we left off, get that little care package over yonder, and then we are going to go ahead, after we get that care package, go investigate what our options are for fighting a brontosaurus. Because I think... I think it's about that time. If we die here, to be perfectly honest, it's not that big of a deal. If we're dying close by our bases or where we left a bed, and I actually thought about this for a while, I think in the future if we go anywhere, I'm going to want to make a bed in certain safe zones. That way I just set up a bed, I can warp to the place where I died, pick up my stuff, move on with my life. I think that's a pretty smart way to go. And hey, look at that! It is a whole bunch of basic ingredients. and Like, yeah, basic materials. Good stuff. That was actually 100% worthwhile. Alright, but let's go ahead and experiment with this fella right here. Now, I'm not entirely sure how this will end up playing out, but I'm hoping it will play out well. So, I'm going to put a foundation right there. I'm going to put some walls. Okay, and then I'm going to take said walls, demolish them. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Put up some new walls. Alrighty. And then we will add a door frame and a ceiling. Oh, it was from a care package. We do have a door. Alright, so add a ceiling, add a door frame, and add a door. So it's cozy. I'm sure some of you are like, what does this have anything to do with capturing a dinosaur? Well, let me tell you. I have captured many a dinosaur in my time. I refuse to do it in a pleb-like way. So, instead... Whoop, that's not what I meant to do. So what we're going to do is we're going to attempt to do this in the best, most professional chuggable way possible. Did it... Did it hit? I don't even know. Oh, yep, yep, okay, it's mad. <laughs> Alright, so we're going to let this guy come towards us a little bit. I'm going to probably launch a couple of these bad boys. Alright, I'm hoping that little house that we just made is going to block him a little bit, at least. Oh, it is! Oh, perfect! It's working! The master plan! Shoot it down! My little hut! Wesley89, thank you very much for subscribing! I'm in the middle of taming a brontosaurus. Or trying to, at least. Oi, what the flip? The heck just hit me? Did you just bite me? Yo, that's a long-range bite, though. Kudos to you. Freaking champion. Oh, we might actually run out of trank arrows. I didn't even think of that being a possibility here, to be completely honest with you guys. Alright, so slingshots. Let's hope that slingshots are effective against giant brontosauruses. Good thing we are picking up stone, though, actually. Like, holy cow. Alright. Man, these things are resilient. This brontosaurus is just like, I don't give no crepes, mate. Like, holy dang. Can you just please... KO, please? Was that it? Yes! We did it! 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 We oh! Ah! Wait! Um! Ah! Do you eat meat? No, you, you probably eat, whatchamacallit, berries. Um, I'll be right back. Don't, don't you get up or anything. Good God. Uh, berries! Berries! All the berries! Why are there no berries here? Fleep! Okay, um... Berries, berries, berries. Up the hill, up the hill, up the hill. Up the hill. Okay. Fiber. That's great and everything, but I really could use some berries. Alright. Okay, let's get the taming process going. I think we still have the tame speed up quite a bit, so we might actually be able to, like, speed tame him. So I don't have to sit here 300 years gathering berries forever and ever and ever. Did it eat one? There we go. 
Are you kidding? It just scarfed that food down. What is wrong with you? It literally just like, it was like a vacuum cleaner. It was just like, all right, goodbye. Eating all my food. Like, what are you, mate? Freaking demon brontosaurus eating my food. All right. All right, we... <laughs> I don't know if you guys can hear me like frantically clicking. I'm like, come on, I need all the berries. Like, but come on, mate. This is, we got a brontosaurus down. This is not an everyday kind of situation. Come on. Come on. All right. That will work for now. Got some extra narco berry hype going on here. Got some more stones, which was our original mission, but we completely forgot about it, obviously, because rocket surgery. Okay, already ate through all the berries. You are a monster. How do you eat that many berries? Are you kidding? Thing is a beast. Alrighty. Gather the. Oh, man, I'm pooping. Alrighty. Gather Areno. I've been thinking about upping my um, resource collection rate. Like, you know the sliders at the beginning where it makes me like, oh, would you like to be able to tame things faster, stuff like that? I think I might actually upgrade my resource collection rate just because I think it's going to get more and more expensive to do things. And I think that's in order for it to be balanced in a multiplayer situation. But uh, single player world, mate. So, uh, yeah, can't, can't really get much help here. It's, uh, it's very lonely. Okay. Let's go ahead and throw down some thatch into here, light the fire. We're not barbarians, darn it, we live in civilized times. The berry chest? Yeah, I know the berry chest. I will make my way over there. I'm just going to gather these berries right here because it's going to take some time for them to respawn. So I'm going to get some berries, I'm going to throw them down onto El Brontosaurus and then go back. Good grief. Okay. And this is with a sped up, um, it's with a sped up taming time, and it's still super duper slow. And it's crazy, because it's, it's so slow. And someone, I, I forgot who it was, but someone linked me or told me on Twitter, I think. They're like, yeah, by the by, taming Brontosaurus is going to take like five hours. And I was just like, you say what? <laughs> I am not going to wait five hours for a brontosaurus. I mean, brontosauri, don't get me wrong, and that's totally not what you call a plural of a brontosaurus, but I am not waiting freaking five hours to tame a brontosaurus and the entire time freaking out going, I need narco berries, I need narco berries, I need narco berries. It's just ridiculous. I refuse to believe that. All right, so let's go ahead and get to the berry chest. It'll be very nice to get my very good berry hype. Bur burying on. Yes, I think I, I think I did good. I think I did a good. <laughs> All right. Okay, head on over here. This torch is still burning, huh? And we're good on resources, honestly. Let's get over to. Wait, I'm drunk. Where am I going? I'm going this way. Alright, so we're going to go over here. Berries in here? Nope. Oh, remember how we're looking for stone? Yeah, we have lots of stone right there. Dur. Fiber. Lots of it per use. Alright, berry, 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 berry. And we'll drop off the stem berries because stem berries, for whatever reason, are super duper heavy. And then we'll head on over. Back to El Brontosoro. Oh, man. Now, if I understand correctly, a Brontosaurus is able to collect berries like a mad dude. boy. Wesley has donated $5 in one cent. Sorry it took so long to sub. It didn't have a card. Here's a donation to make up for it. <laughs> thank you for subbing and also thank you for the donation. It is perfectly okay to not sub or donate. I mean, honestly, and this is very true for everyone. Thank you all so much for watching all the content. If you watch it on YouTube, Twitch, or both, especially both, I mean, you are a trooper if you do both.
but thank you all so much for watching. It really it makes a huge world of difference. Um, I, I don't know if I am quite as articulate or as outspoken about that as I should be, but it really does make a huge difference, and it isn't about the uh, donations or the subs and all that stuff, although it's nice to have those things. But honestly, just by being on the stream, being on active on YouTube, stuff like that, it helps us all out a lot. And of course, it's what we it's what we got into it for, right? So always, always a great, great thing to see. Just kind of people around and about. Although you won't hear me complaining if you donate, Kappa. <laughs> but let me see here. Let me go back to Bronto. Just wanted to show my support. Well, that's very nice of you, Wesley. And then... Alright, we're making some good progress. Thank goodness for that upgraded speed, though. That would have been monstrously terrible had I not had that. Alright. Have that all going and running. And I think, honestly, because of the way that the taming speed is right now, I think we'll be A-OK. -okay. It has a huge knockout time. So I think we're actually... A okay for that whole uh, taming session right there. I think that's all we needed. But just in case, and also just kind of make ourselves useful right now, I'm going to go out here, scout for some burras. Do a burra good job. Let me see here. I need some more food in my belly. I just ate so much food. Okay. I wonder if my guy misses like regular food. He probably does. I'd imagine if you're out in the wilderness for a while, all you would want is a grilled cheese. Just like the most processed grilled cheese of your life. And just because like you haven't had normal food in so long, you'd be like, Yes. Really, really cold pizza. Yes, this is what I've been dreaming of. I wonder if he craves those things. I don't know. This is what I wonder about in my off time. If you ever wondered what happens in my brain, this is this is what goes down. It's pretty it's pretty random and pleb. But let's go break down some stone. You are a brontosaurus, not a giant rock. It is really kind of terrifying to think about how I just confused a boulder for a brontosaurus. These brontosauri are just that big. Alright. And then that's just remnants of a stone. This is not a brontosaurus. This is an actual rock. Always great. Come on. Now I am pretty low on stamina, so let's let the little thunder bar get back. drinking peach tea peach tea is quite nice some people don't like it I think it's quite good and I pooped alrighty boom 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 <laughs> oh my gosh I just glanced over a chat let's see who was it Text is like a grilled cheese with bacon and berries. I just imagine someone taking a grilled cheese and putting berries inside of it. Ooh. Wesley donated another five dollars. Having wanted to donate, I went and got a card just for you, Kappa. Here's more. Aw, thanks, Wesley. You really don't have to do that though. If you'd like to get something for yourself or go around and shop for five things at the dollar store, probably four with tax, but hey man, you never know. They have some gems in there. Got my first kazoo from a dollar store. Was five well, not five dollars. It was like dollar and like fifty cents or something like that. But good spend of my money. I never knew what a kazoo was until I went there, and I was like, "Wow, it's a kazoo!" And I really, really wanted to use it. No idea where it is now, but I had a kazoo at some point. All right, and then we'll go get this. What does peach tea taste like? It actually tastes like I think it's white peaches. It it tastes like white peaches, but instead of it just being white peaches it has that little bit of a lemony iced tea thing going on so I think it's quite nice I drink this the a diet snapple one I don't know what it is but ever since um ever since like I got used to drinking diet pop because my dad can only drink diet pop he has diabetes and so he's like oh I know it's diabetes but I, I prefer to call it diabetes because it reminds me of Jerome Bettis and that makes me really really like Ooh, aren't we swag? But um, yeah, ever since I started drinking diet pops, that's so I got used to the taste, I guess. And so, like, if I have an option between regular and diet, I'll generally drink diet. There's some moments where I'll feel like, oh, you know, I feel like having like a regular one with sugar in it, but I like diet, and I've never seen anything that says 
conclusively that anything's bad about aspartame. I mean, with, as with all things, it's not good to have too much of something, but in general, it's quite good. So I'm happy with my diet pops. Let me go over here. Millions of peaches, peaches for me. Love you, Chug. Well, thank you very much, EJ, TJ. Whoa. Oh my, we're gonna get a donation train going. Love you, Chogo. Keep on going on. Well, thank you, D. Tonys? I'm looking at that name. I'm. Huh? I probably just butchered that. I'm sorry. I don't mean to be rude and butcher your names, but sometimes when you read a name, it just does not click in the brain. I also want to take this raw meat back. You don't deserve it. Dad Yum Bronto. But look at this thing, it's still taming. This is gonna keep on taming for 300 bajillion years. Alright, you're cold, you should find warmth soon. Well, you know what, game? I think you're cold, and you should find some warmth soon. How do you like that, jerk? Alright. Let's go back, make some cementing paste. It's about time I got a replacement for my water skin, though, because this thing leaks water. I don't know if you guys can see that, but as I go around, it slowly loses some of its water content. So... <laughs> Someone said, oh, if you don't drink too much, they said half liters. I'm sitting here like, that's not for a two liter bottle. What are you doing? <laughs> I drink a lot of pop. Although I haven't been drinking as much pop lately. I've been I've been kind of toning down a little bit on the on the popper roonies. But I, I do have the ability to drink quite a bit of pop. Not as much as I used to, but I do drink still quite a bit compared to other people. Fleep's sake, the donations are everywhere today. Choo choo. Oh god, donation train. Thanks, Skippy. You little ferrets with your donation trains. And let's go up. Someone said tame a T Rex. It's a struggle for life itself against a T Rex, let alone taming one. <laughs> All right, let's see here. Ooh, we're actually getting quite close in terms of our goal for stone. Oh, look at that. This is actually so pretty, isn't it though? Well, my mind is the giant obelisk of green death, but isn't that pretty? I think it's pretty. And you just get to see the sunrise. If I did this, if I had to go do this offline, could you just imagine how annoying it'd be? Because you know you'd be standing out there, it's kind of muggy, it's kind of warm, it's humid, mosquitoes are everywhere, freaking bugs nipping at your butt. And I can do this in the safety and comfort of my own home. <laughs> I am I am one step away from becoming a neat, which is like the Japanese expression or thing that they made up, the acronym for like, you're neither being educated, employed, or... Um, Neither being educated, employed, or something else. For what T is, for what the last one is, but yeah, it's it was yeah. I'm I'm turning into a neat. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. I'm I'm pretty close to turning into a neat. <laughs> All right, let's go check this out. I shouldn't laugh about that. That's actually probably something I should be a little bit concerned about. But who gives a darn? All right, let me see here. No, I want to put the wait. What? What did I just do with my metal? I swear, I just had met. What happened to it? Huh? Am I drunk? Do what the heck just happened here? I'm gonna put some wood into there. I swear, I just had. What's happening? <laughs> Oh no, I need a whole bunch of this carrots and stuff. What you get from Animerge. Actually, let me drop off another 100 wood in here while I'm here. Um, Curitin, 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 Curitin. Curitin. Or training, thank you, that's what it is. Training was the last one, I forgot that one. Good catch, good catch. Whoa, what is going on? Is it just me or am I moving super? Am I moving super fast? No, well, you're all good. I'm not concerned. Alright, access inventory. Oh, you still got plenty of meat going here. Buddy, how you doing? You doing alright? Alright, both the trikes are doing good. 
Oh no, it's a freaking train of doom. Wesley, thank you very much for donating. I want to be part of the donation train. You already were! You little ferret. Oh my lanta, this is getting ridiculous now. Tex, thank you for donating. Fleep sake. Oh wait. Tex wrote, I want to be part of the donation train. And then Wesley said, more, you really are the best in Frosted. What? I've subbed to... I've subbed to and only one I've donated to, so it's donation hype. Oh, cool. Well, thank you. I, ho I hope it's worthwhile. Man, I'm, I feel like I'm, there's some pressure going on now. It's like, you better not freaking screw up, Choco. This person, you're his first. You better not be freaking bad. I'll be like, do not beat me. All right, so let's see. Put some stone into here. Put some cured. The flip is going on here. Okay, stone, curatin. Alright, and then I need I need more stone than that. I need nine more stone, I think. I need some more curatin as well. Which I think I have a whole bunch in here, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah. Yeah, I have a bunch of it in here. Alright, and we actually also have 45 stone! That's perfect! Alright, back up we go. Over to the mortar and pestle. Drop this off. Cool beans. And the Donoshi. And Hushi is now involved. It's over nine! <laughs> you weasel. Just keep the train going for the awesome Chocobo. P.S. Don't worry, I got lots of money. Who says that, Hushi? Who in the world says, oh, by the by, I have lots of money? For Fleep's sake, Hushi. My god. There are some things you say, and there's some things you just don't. <laughs> One job, man. He had one job. Oh no. I'm out of tea. I kind of want water. Oh, so many things. Alright. Cementing paste into thar. And then... Let's craft... I need 15? I thought I needed 5! 15?! Wait, why is it not crafting more? Can I only fit like a certain amount in here or something? What is going on here? I don't know what's going on. Oh, I don't have enough keratin. I need keratin or chitin. Or chitin? I don't even know what it is. We need four more, so I need... So we need so we need thirteen more. I don't know if we have that to be honest. I know I can go fight some turtles for it, but I'm dehydrated. Well, that wouldn't be happening if I had my dad gum. What you call it? Water bottle, water jar. All right, let's see here. No, that's not what we're looking for. Okay, well there's three. A little dent in there, but need more than that. All right, well, I need to go pick a fight with a turtle, apparently. So if oh, well, I know he said turtle, but you know, nope. I don't know what it is. I think I'm just competitive. I'm like, as a bird, I just determined that we have to make sure other birds don't get in the way for glory. But we have to keep an eye out for the turtles. Some people like turtles, and they're just really nice to them. I hunt them for sport. I'm a terrible ferret. Mer -ner 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 -ner. Alrighty. And then. Bronto. Thank goodness his head did not land in the water. Like, actually, that could have been rip. Oh, hush your face. You're fine. You're fine, Randy Dandy guy. You're fine. Drink some more water. L'Oreal, you're worth it. Alright. Let's go check on this guy. I just realized this guy has like spines. What the? Oh. I just grabbed the Bronto and I was about to be like, Come here, boy! Is that him chewing? I think it is. Oh, hey, Wesley. Alright, let me read this, this real quick. Don't be scared of donation. We love you and your reaction is priceless. 
Oh, it may. I feel really, really concerned. That's a lot of money that's being thrown around today. Okay, spear broke. That's not good. I'm down to my last spear, actually. No, not a good time for lag. Dead got my lag. All right. Now, I think I want to use this, right? Yeah, let's get... Oh! Ah! What the shrimp? Dad, come it. Oh, no. Oh, God. This is not what we had hoped for. Come on. Yeah, that's right. So I have to get close enough for it to want to hit me. Oh my gosh. Alright. The one arrow of justice. Boom. Literally 100% calculated. That was actually quite good. Alright, let's go wrap this up with this guy. All he had left was three hide, little ferret. Alright, let's go check out how he's doing. Actually, how is my house doing? This thing protected me from definite death. Yeah, that was pretty... Quite a good strategy, if I do say so myself. Yeah, he's knocked out for a while. He's about halfway done, so it's going to be another episode, I think, until that's all settled and squared away. But let's see here. We need wood. We need more wood in order to make more spears, in order to kill more turtles. So let me go ahead, chop down some trees. Okay. Okay, that's tree number... Th or, not tree, that's spear number three. That should be good enough for now. Alright, what's that say? Say hi to Momo, choo-choo. Don $10 donation from Skippy. Oh, Bay's here? Bay? Hey, Bay. I'm fighting dinosaurs, you proud of me? No buffalo involved, though. Alright. Come here, you old bugger. That's right. You ain't... You don't even go here. Come on. I'm like, actually, I feel like a Spartan with the way I'm moving. I'm like, Spartans! Okay, as I say that, I start failing every single spear. But like, you just... Just a little tiny bit, and then you just get it done. Just little tiny movements. I wrote choo choo. Well, you are a, you are a train. I I believe that you are the train that you always wish you could be. A repair item. Let me see here. I think that's all we need for Kiritan. I think that's the exact amount we needed. So that actually works out pretty well. All right, well, let me go see what this is all about. Let me see if I can get a water jar before we end the episode. But, um, I don't know. We'll see. Let me go over here. Check this out. I really should just, I should bring one of my dinosaurs here. I really just should. But, oh, well, what can you do? Oh, you look stuck. You also look dead. Plenty of raw meat, though. We haven't had much of a meat shortage, which is good. I'm actually quite, quite pleased with our lack thereof requirements for that. Alrighty, up the hill we go. Let's get that one trike that's just stuck. Alright, and then take a little skadoodles and go ahead and use my water skin, which I'm probably never going to use ever again. Tib H. Let me see. Um, Alright, so let's put the water skin away, because I'm not planning to use the water skin anymore after this. And then let me take the curatin. Whoop. We're going to make four more paste, I believe. So let's throw the curatin in there. I am one off, aren't I? I am one stinking curatin away. Turtle. Is there no turtle that's willing to sacrifice their life for science? Aha! Science turtle. I knew I could depend on you, science turtle. 
You always come through in times of great need. Whatcha? Uh oh, the other one's mad at me too now. You must further my needs for science. Oh, you're boosted now because your your girlfriend's over here. All right, well, I do not question. We all need our bays. Hey, we leveled up. Nice. Give me one keratin. That's all I ask for. Just one between the two of you. Thank you. Hey. Should I use it? Oh, never mind. I think that gives me more keratin and hide, actually. So we should probably do that in the future. Whoopsies. All right. Oh, a dodo. It's so cute. Wow, you are a strong dodo bird. Did you guys see that? Just ate a spear. The spear is bigger than its whole body. What the shrimp? Friend, super durable dodo bird. All right, Kiritsen. Right. One more. Another donation from Hushy Love. Ten. Roar! I'm a dinosaur. Please don't kill me, Keck. Choo choo. My Lanta. The donation stream apparently. All right, let's see here. I'm thinking maybe stamina is the way to go, honestly. Although, movement speed probably is a little bit more important. And I just watched me poop. That fell from here. I do not poop from the front. I'm not going to. Whatever. I, I can't be bothered to question how this game works sometimes. Just, I just can't be bothered. Um, you know what? I'm actually going to... Let's get the... Let's get this up a little bit more. I know I have a whole bunch of levels here. We still haven't unlocked the gun. Dad gummit. I really want that gun. All right, cementing paste in here. We now have 15. Good. Now we can make the jar. All right, craft. And then after that, we need to get 50 stone and 30 wood. Easy peasy. But for now, I think we're gonna call it here pretty soon. Carries a lot of water, but it's pretty heavy. But that's okay, honestly. It's only five weight. It's not that bad. I mean. Pretty bad, but it's not that bad. It could be a lot worse. Alright, and then just take a little bit of a drink. And do I lose water as I run around? Let's see here. Does it tell me? Safely carries a lot of water. I don't think this one leaks. I don't think it's leaking at all. Alright, well that's good. I'm actually quite okay with that. So, we accomplished our goals for now. And... I think the next thing on the list is I need to actually... Well, we have to make sure that the Brontosaurus is tamed. But besides that, the main objective now is to get that smithy going. So that will be the next thing. Um, but we're going to go ahead and call it there for the episode. So if you guys enjoyed, be sure to hit the like button down below. Subscribe to the channel if you are new and you're enjoying all the different kinds of content. And I'll see you guys another time. Take care. Keep going. Keep going. Take care. And ciao for now.